What's up you guys? It's Valeria and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Now, as many of you guys know, 2020 is coming to an end, thankfully, because I don't know about you guys, but I've been really wanting this year to end, mostly because of how hard and challenging it was just for all of us as a community. I feel like 2020 had definitely a lot of challenges than many other years. I mean, guys, we lived in a freaking pandemic. We're currently still in a pandemic. But anyways, I really wanted this video to be a new year resolutions because I don't know about you guys, but every single year since I was smaller, I've been so interested in like writing my goals. Now, I really want you guys to take away from this video some inspiration and maybe even some goals that you guys would love to achieve. Another thing, all these goals that I'm stating in this video are just mainly used for ideas, just for inspiration for you guys whenever you're thinking about writing your 2021 goals be sharing some of my personal goals that I have and maybe you can guys grab some and I'm also going to be sharing like more generic goals that can be used for every single day and just to make yourself a better person for the new year so let's get into my 2021 new year's resolutions so right here i have my bullet journal if you guys know me on a personal level or even honestly just follow my socials i am super into bullet journaling like i've had this bullet journal since last year in december and guys it's literally almost finished these are just all my youtube ideas that i have and i like write them daily now, I know that this is a very average goal for everyone, but losing weight, healthy weight gain, or just looking good and feeling better about yourself is a goal I feel everyone should have. And it's a very common one too. But one thing I would say about this is not to force yourself to do something that you don't wanna do. Of course, it takes motivation to lose weight and to gain healthy weight. It's all part of life. But I would really say just to have like one personal goal that you would wanna achieve. Like, okay, I'ma have just to get my body moving whether that's yoga whether that's an actual intense workout whether that is just dancing to your favorite songs like any of that will help you and just trust me progress to see in your physical body takes a really long time so don't get let down if you don't see these goals happen immediately like in a snap of a finger journaling and manifestation is something you should definitely input into your 2021 new years i am so into manifestation you guys like i'm gonna tell you on the realest note manifestation to me is like such a reality and i feel like it's so accomplishable to anyone who's watching this video that life is a lot more simple than we make it seem it's actually not as complex and it's helped me really relax my stress and anxiety that sometimes I tend to get. I actually have a ton of books. So one of my other goals is to read a lot more. As you guys can see, I have so many books right in my hands. And I really want to get reading them. Now, I don't know, you guys, but I really am like a shopaholic. Like, I will get obsessed with something and I will shop everything about it. Like, that's going to be the only thing I'll talk about for an entire month until I get it. And then I'll probably forget about it. But here I have some amazing books. I'm really into, like, what is this called? I'm really into personal growth books. My cousin actually got me into this and I'm obsessed with it. So these are actually some good books. If you guys want to like take a picture, I definitely do because I'm obsessed with all these books. Another thing you guys can do is have a clean room. One tip that I've actually learned a lot is making your bed every single morning. Now, I used to never make my bed ever and just recently I started doing that and I feel just so much more nicer when I do it so maybe cleaning your room having an organized space remember trust me it's something that might seem hard for everyone but it can be something implemented and it's really easy anyways another goal that I really want to do is to find new ways on how I can take care of myself this includes self-care self-love all that jazz just so I can get more on my game so I can you know find new stuff to how to get myself more distracted when I'm stressed and all that type of stuff so yeah I also really want to try to journal every single day I feel like putting your feelings onto paper is super important like journaling is so important to me now I used to not like it but now I just like putting out all my feelings in paper and not keeping it in my head because you start thinking about those stuff and it's just like no 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 like negative negative too negative for me you get me 
I also want to go to sleep earlier. I don't know about you guys, but like being a teenager and going to sleep late kind of freaking sucks. I've been going to sleep every single day at 11.30, but I used to go to sleep every single day like at 2 a.m. And it was like so bad because I would wake up so tired and I hated it. Like I hated it so much that to the point I was like, dude, what the heck am I going to do with my life? But you know what? Like whatever, it's fine. I'm also really trying to find a new hobby that I love just as much as dancing. As many of you guys know, I've been a competitive dancer for, I would say, six years now. And I stopped being a competitive dancer because I wanted to focus more on YouTube and the passion that I have for this, for creating content and being on the internet and like, I don't know, talking to all of you guys because honestly, like being on youtube was probably the best thing that has ever happened to me these past two years i feel like i really found so much about myself these past years another thing you guys can do is give out more compliments to yourself and to other people now i know sometimes it can be kind of intimidating to just go up to a person and be like hey i really like your outfit and i think you're doing amazing but just know that that can make someone's day and imagine if someone went up to you and told you wow you look really good today your makeup is bomb like girl you're killing it like i would honestly feel amazing after that and also is looking at yourself in the mirror and saying three things that you love about yourself every morning like positive affirmations and that will actually help you out a lot with body confidence and looking at yourself differently than other people see you 2020 was a year I thought I was gonna travel so much but unfortunately I couldn't because a freaking pandemic ruined it all but you know what whatever whatever it's fine I just really hope next year I can travel so much more to so many places like what if one really place I really really want to go to is Iceland you guys like Iceland to me is like the most prettiest place on this planet it's beautiful it's exotic I don't know I'm just like obsessed with it Drinking water every day is actually extremely important. I've noticed that personally, sometimes I forget to drink water just because I do so much in my days that I just forget. But this year, I really wanna start drinking more water just because it helps you clear your skin out. If anyone is struggling with acne in this video, trust me that when you drink water, it's like detoxing your system. So if you want better skin, girl, drink some more water. It's actually gonna be super beneficial for your glowing skin. But just besides that, it's just good for your health overall. Open to all change and to be accepting of every single change because your life is just consistent of change. So one thing that I really wanna input for next year is to just realize that change happens everywhere and to just accept it, grow from it, and learn from it. That's probably one of my biggest things that I wanna take into next year to really walk in with an open mind and to really learn other stuff that I'm not used to. And meditation is something that really can help you mentally and just to bring awareness to your life and just so you know that everyday struggles happens to everyone and meditation is something that has really helped me clear my mind when I'm at my most worst and it's something that I think everyone should do but of course it's not for everyone but you should try it out definitely one of these days. I also really want to work on myself as a person and learn to grow and all that jazz. And lastly, the thing that I want to do the most for next year is get an exciting project that I'm actually working on right now. And hopefully by next year, I think March or February, it should be up and all you guys will get to see it. You guys, like, I don't think you understand how important this is to me. Like, I'm a very, I'm a person that really strikes for the best in life. And I don't know, that's just the way I am. But yeah, anyways, I really hope you guys have a good time and try to really have a really good year. I will see you guys soon. I think most likely before the year ends. Like, I don't know. I have so much love to all you guys. Like, I'm literally about to cry right now just talking about you guys. But also check out my nails because they're like super freaking cute and I got them done. <laughs> and I'll see you all in the next video. But for now, bye guys. Peace. Peace.